Hey, Max here from Kids Fishing TV. In today's video, I'm going to give you folks a tip. Um, it's an alternative to the Wacky Rigger. If you heard of the Wacky Rigger, essentially what it is, is it's a band you put around your Senko to make your Wacky Rig last longer. And so, I definitely recommend going out there and buying the Wacky Rigger. It's a great company, the people there are great, but you order one, it takes seven days to get to your house, and you need an emergency one because uh, you want to go out there fishing and use a wacky worm and save money or you don't have the money to spend on the wacky rigger here's an alternative that you can do it should work just as well it's just a little bit harder to put onto your bait well with that said I'm gonna show you folks how to uh, how to make an alternative to the wacky rigger so there are essentially only three supplies that you need in order to uh, to make this little wacky rigger alternative work and the three supplies number one is your hook number two is your Senko and number three is this little hair elastic and now I guess women use this hair elastic somewhere in their hair not sure how it works um but you can find these basically in any hair product section at your supermarket or at a Walmart or basically any place that carries stuff like shampoo or brushes or combs stuff like that they should probably have these I guess it's a common thing that girls use in their hair um, or if you're a kid like me and you have a sister, you're definitely going to find some of these around on the floor that you can use. What you're going to want to do is you get this little elastic and you, um, you double it over your fingers, just like that. Again, what you do, you put that ring around your fingers like this, you bring it up, you twist it, and you put it back around. So. You have that elastic tightly around your fingers. Now pull your fingers apart, slide the worm through about halfway, and then slide the elastic off your fingers so that now the elastic is on the worm. It doesn't look very good, but fish, you know, especially bass, they're not going to really give to to craps about having a little elastic on their worm. Um, and you can get these things in thousands of different colors. Uh, you can get them basically fine-tuned to the color of your worm, or you can just go ahead and get a clear one, which um, you know will always work. So you have your elastic on your worm now. Now what you can do now, instead of actually putting your hook through the worm, you just put it right under the elastic. You can put it through the worm a little bit, but that elastic is really going to help you uh, keep your bait on longer. So having that elastic on your worm is going to make a huge, huge, huge difference in uh, keeping your bait on your hook. I mean, you can probably fish this thing, you know, 10 times as much as you would if you were just using your normal Senko. And the only thing that can basically go wrong with it is the legs get ripped off by a fish. Or a big fish grabs the legs and will be able to rip the elastic. But if you're fishing a Senko, and you make a really hard hook set, a lot of times it falls off. That's not going to happen with this. All that's going to happen is it's going to stretch. Anyways, that is the alternative to the Wacky Rigger. I hope this helped you folks. Um, I hope this saves you some money when you're using a Wacky Worm. And until next time, God bless, tight lines. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Every subscription counts. Be sure to like this video because, again, every like counts. So see you folks next time. If you have any... Um, if you have any video suggestions, you want me to make a video on something, you want me to uh, come up with another alternative of a product out there, let me know. I'll be sure to uh, get back to you and hopefully make a video for you. And God bless the tight line. See you folks next time. For more entertaining and informative videos, please click on one of the boxes below.